American music, okay, so um, that's why you should not treat it like it's Russian music. Uh, in, in that sense, the textures are a little bit uh, not as, as thick as Russian contemporary music, okay? Uh, so you have to find where all of the, 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 the melodies are, how, how do you make it understandable for your audience, uh, so that it becomes more, uh, more transparent. Okay, I like using that word uh, because sometimes when your audiences are confused, uh, that means the, the music is not transparent. Okay, so let's let's do it. What what one one good thing about uh, contemporary music is that. Uh, you just have to follow exactly what the composer wants because uh, some of them are still living, right? Uh, and e exaggerating what, what, what they mark down in their scores, right? So, for example, in this opening, uh, it says piano, but you would, your, your dynamic range has to be a little bit uh, widened, a little bit more widened. Uh, not just uh, six layers, but some something or uh, six levels of dynamic, but rather more like 64 levels. Okay, so um, the only way to do that is to make the pianos even more like uh, exponentially softer. So if you see a piano in the score, think it has to be three-piece, okay? Three, pianissimo, pianissimo, okay? So that once you pull it down, the, the dynamic system uh, pulling down when it's softer or, or pulling up when it's louder, uh, you have more room to, to create different levels of, of dynamics and color, okay? Okay, so let's start with this and let's, let's go with pianissimo and then the mezzo forte, 
that comes uh, six measures later, try to put it that, peg that as piano, okay? So it's three levels down. That's what we're trying to do. And then when it's forte, so you, have, it, you don't have to exert so much effort to make everything louder, right? It's easier to make the effort of making something softer than, than trying to make something louder, okay? Let's try this. Really soft and light, okay? It, it, it's, you know, toccatas, even in box time, we're not really heavy, you know? Uh, even the Schumann toccata or the Prokofiev toccata, you know, they're, they're not really heavy. They're, they're very light, okay? crescendo, make it gradual, not sudden, okay? So if you, if you do start out really soft, you have more room to make that gradual. Don't, don't think about that as mezzo forte. Make that something like mezzo piano or piano, okay? But, but we would like to see the gradual increasing, right? statement. You have so much more to go, right? And, and where, where the, the, the climax of this whole thing is it's all those chords. Bam, 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 right? Right? So preserve your energy, right? Conserve your energy and, 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 and make it like a volcano that slowly boils, right? Heats up, boils, and then eventually explodes, right? Try it again. Okay, good, better. How about, are you using pedal at all here? No? How about pedaling on the accents instead of making it louder? It's a different color. You're doing the accent, but you're doing it with pedal. Try it again. Okay, good, better. How about here? What are the what are the, the harmonies here? together with the pedal. Let's see. Da -da -da -da. Off, off on the C sharp. Put it down again. Ah, that's different, right? Okay. So it's, it's like a natural, natural accenting without actually making an accent. All right. It, it, it changes the color of this particular passage. Because compare that, play this again without pedal. Listen to it carefully. Yeah, kind of corny, right? You would want to hear overtones of harmonies that are so distorted, you know, they're intriguing harmonies, okay? Yeah, try it again. non-accented chord. Different color. Great. Okay. Here, uh, do it again from here. Okay, let's see. This is one harmony, isn't it? 
let's see what happens if you pedal from here up to here and then take off the pedal uh, in the A flat. Let's see what happens. I just want to hear it. With the What do you think? Do you like it? You have, you have now the option of, of, of accepting that proposal or not. Listen to it again. Do it the way you used to do it and then do it the way uh, I would interpret it. So it helps you to c control the, the, the pulse, if you put pedal. I, I'm thinking of color, I'm not thinking, I think your pulse is fine, you know, I don't have, a, I don't have a, an issue with that. I think that what you're doing uh, is keeping the pulse very well, you know, it's very rhythmic, and it's very, I, if there was any kind of rushing, it's very little, it's not really noticeable. But I'm talking specifically about color. You know, not everything is dry. Sometimes when you see a, 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 a harmonic structure like that, then you, you pedal it and collect it, right? It, it changes the, the, the face of, of this whole line, okay? Let's try it again. naturally very loud, right? Good, so th that shows you that, uh, or it, it helps you relax more, right? Now here, when you get to the piano leggero, same level, dynamic level as this, and the left hand has to be super staccato. Oh, yes, creepy. <laughs> creepy, but beautiful. <laughs> okay, do it. Naturally, for you, was that you change the pedal here? Yeah, yeah, right, right. It, it came naturally for you to, to change the pedal. You, instinctively, you change the pedal. So let's stick with what your instincts are telling you to do. Okay, let's go with that. Pedal, pedal, release, uh, pedal through. 
pedal, pedal, pedal through, pedal, pedal, pedal through. So, thang, 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 but when okay, so that it, it changes the the texture and and, and the colors of, of all of these of this whole page. Try it again. This the G's are lyrical, right? And this one is a little bit pluck, blum, 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 right? And this one, but legato. Try, try the gato. Yeah. Right. And then this one's plop, right? Plump, 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 plump. So you have different layers. together the same texture okay so that it, it has different layers try again goes to the, to the right hand, okay? They switch roles, okay? Try it again. Good. Now, also 
this. You know, I'm, I'm not, not so, you know, a staccato does not have to be super short all the time, you know. It's just saying, separate this from the next one, okay? Uh, so if this seems lyrical, it's a, it's a short, yum, 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 right? But this one is very light, okay? Good. Nice, it's better. so that it, it sounds more round and, and, and grand, okay? All right, try that again.
figure and then you have this wet dry okay tension in silence it's like a horror movie you know when it's really silent when it's really quiet that's the scariest part okay so extend that that mystery and that, 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 that tension in silence okay all right from here again good you're using your wrist because you know you want it to sound round big and round but not Harsh, not percussive, okay? Consistency say pam pam rest pam pam don't make this longer or this one longer any of them they should be all equal they're all quarters okay Avoid, avoid pedal in that kazan. 
gigante, it, it, you know, if, if it's dry and it's heavy, you, you're achieving the pesante. But so don't put pedal, but use your arm. Arm off the wrist. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Okay, uh, you're still lengthening this a little bit longer than this. So, pam, 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 Experiment on all of those and explore those pedalings that we talked about. You know, give yourself different options. Uh, uh, don't limit yourself to just wet and dry. You know, listen to the to the to the harmonies and the tones. Why is he? Why am I putting pedal throughout this? What is that harmony? Okay, what kind of color do I want out of this phrase or out of this line? What is the character? It's like you're building an opera uh, based on a tonality. All right? Good. Great. Thank you so much, Benedict. 